Things are getting good. Things are getting good in the neighborhood. What I am extremely excited about is this new feature that Morgan just dropped. For those of you that don't know, Morgan Calendar is my favorite calendar app. Shout out to the team there. They've been great to me. I do content on their channel as a big old face of the company a little bit over there. And I am so excited to announce the fact that they have this. And what this is, is a command bar. You see that? When you press Control K, you can see right here. And as you can see, if you're hovered on the create event or create task, it'll give you some tips at the bottom. So for example, if I create the task, make dinner slash growth, oh, boom, I can do that. But when is it? At means for people, so it's just for me. So if I did an at and there was like team members, I could have them there. And then I could put a location with a semicolon as well. So I put Chicago, that's where I'm from. And then I put a little tag for, I got one for a break and planning and traveling. I don't actually have one for this. So let's change the example. I press escape to get out of it. Let's do it again. Big social event drive. <laughs> I'm so dumb. And then I could put a tag for traveling. So I say I had a big social event. Uh, I could save the event. Then you would see it would put it right there. So let's show you another way that you can prompt this. So this is a little bit different, but if I press Control Shift K, as you can see, it'll bring me to Morgan right here. Now I did put a little bit of feedback in so that this would just pop up anywhere similar to what Todoist does. As you can see, if I go into Todoist, my recommendation for them is having it so that the quick add like this works the exact same way anywhere. So you notice how I press quick add here and it pops up in Morgan or on my desktop, just like this. In my opinion, it's a lot better because doing Control Shift K, I have to press it twice right now. And it is a solid option, don't get me wrong. I'm appreciative of it, but it's just a little finicky in comparison to what I'm used to. So they're hopefully gonna roll out some nice updates. They were very receptive to feedback. Uh, you can obviously not just type things out, but click things here. And there is natural language processing. As you can see, there's an example here for meeting with John tomorrow at 3 p.m. So I can type this out. Let's do meeting with Vinicius at riseproductive.com. Click on that uh, on Monday at 8 a.m. to 8.30 and then boom, save event. Check it right here. It added it to my calendar, extremely easy. So this is something that a lot of applications have. I know it sounds very simple. I know it's a minor update, but having this in general is something that makes me happy and hopefully it makes you happy. You're also able to open it by clicking on this little like terminal looking thing right here, which is a universal symbol for those of you that don't know. And from a task perspective, you can also do take out the trash and then you can put this and then high priority. It's very similar to the Todoist naming convention of having that exclamation point for priority. And then if I click on that, you'll notice take out the trash goes in my inbox. Now I can also add this to a list. So if I want to take out the trash and you'll know, hover over this and see that you can have the task list with that symbol right here. So let's do growth, high priority. And then boom, it was in this list right here. Now I got to say, name me a calendar app that can do this right now. This is turning more and more into like a daily planner style app. And it is so cool. Some of the other latest changes we have are not only you know, obviously saving events and tasks here, but on Mac, the Morgan bar has a little bit of more advanced look and functionality. The new improvements at Morgan, top tier. Y'all are doing amazing things. Give them feedback. They're very receptive individuals. Love the people there. Had an interview with the CEO on my podcast, the Rise Productive Podcast. If you wanna check that out, link to that down below. And here's another link to a video on how to improve your productivity even more. Check it out, let's do it. You'd love it. You're gonna love it. You're gonna love it.